in this video I play Terraria on For the Worthy Master Mode, but that's not it. I also installed the Calamity mod and played on Revengeance, Death, and Malice Mode, but that's still not it. I also installed the Fargo's mod and played it on Eternity Mode. Let's see how hard the game is. So, boom, Eternity Mode, boom, Revengeance, boom, Death Mode, boom, Malice Mode. All right, let's get it. Let's see how hard this is. Dang, look how fast I am. All right, let's see how hard a slime is. Psh, what? Come on. Come on. I got like six modes activated, and I'm over here still beating up slimes. Come on. I want to see how much damage they do. Damn, they're avoiding me. What? That's it? I was expecting to get insta-killed. I mean, they hurt, but like, I'm expecting an insta-kill, bro. Why would they give me such a good weapon early game? <laughs> this bloody machete is a sleeper early game. I'm dead. Help! I can't swim! If your Terraria character can't swim, how does he jump out of the water? Tell me that. I'm fine for my life out here. This vulture is shooting at me? Did you guys see that? Oh, nah. The vulture got the new AI. I'm dead as f Bad angle to fight that thing at. Terraria characters walk underwater like a giga chat. The motherfucker be sinking to the bottom. And I kind of respect it. Did Shrek 5 ever come out? After like Shrek 3, things get a little hazy, you know? Ah! <laughs> Fuck! I might have missed the rope by a little bit. What the fuck? Did that sand just do 84 damage? What the fuck was that noise? What the hell can make that noise? Why? Hey, hold up. Isn't this a hard mode enemy? <laughs> what the hell makes that noise? <laughs> it's your bar. Oh, the rage bar. Okay. What is this? Lethargic. Ah! Hey, this really hasn't been that hard. I was expecting like... Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> trying to assassinate me right when i start talking about the difficulty anyways like i was saying this isn't really that hard dang look at that i could just craft this stuff what mods allow me to just craft this fargos i thought these difficulty modes are supposed to be hard bro come on now you want the furnace to be the furthest away because the furnace is the one you craft the least amount with as you can see you know, it's usually only used for, like, smelting. So, as a Terraria pro, I've learned that putting the furnace the furthest away just kind of makes sense, right? Thank you, everyone, for coming to my Tip Talks, Tech Tips, TED Talk with Game Raiders. Why does he look like this? It's not how kids look. <laughs> what would y'all give up for a Terraria sex mod update? What would you guys be willing to give up? I'd be willing to give up my first child. Willing to give up a kidney. I would give two inches of my wee wee. Two inches? That's a lot to give up. Some of us can't afford that. I would give away my cat. What if you don't like your cat? I don't see. I don't know if you like your cat or not. Someone said, give up calamity. Come on now. Giving up calamity? That's like you saying like the equivalent of giving up bitches. You don't get no bitches, so there's nothing to give up. I would smash zoologist or stylist first. Nah, you had to like, the mod were to come out, you'd have to go through some shit to unlock even like one female. Cause you start off with the guide, so you gotta, you gotta make do. You gotta make do with the situation that you have. You know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta work your way. Damn. You gotta work your way to unlocking the female terraria characters so you got to start with the guide and then to like unlock the stylus to unlock like any female terraria characters the difficulty is like way harder like you got to go through like hell and back like instead of instead of just going down into like the spider cave to just find the stylus you got to go through a spider dungeon i'm talking about it's like the size of the jungle temple and that's how you got to find her no worries i will go through every male npc you get a buff see that's that's like in like any like fallout or like skyrim game when you sleep with someone in those games you get like a buff like in fallout you usually get like an xp or damage buff what the fuck <gasps> disgusting i like that some enemies have different attacks it's kind of cool <laughs> that's very cool you get like a buff so like every like npc you sleep with you get a buff a different buff and then there's gonna be like a whole relationship system too some npcs they won't really care if you sleep with other ones but then some of them you know they get feelings and if you get caught <laughs> i'm telling you i can make a whole ass 
adventure mod right there. Just give me a team and I'll make the greatest Terraria sex mod ever. Instead of like a bestiary, you get like a Kama Sutra <laughs> that you gotta fill out. And each NPC teaches you a different position. Oh my God, we can make a great mod. Bro, I would make literally the best mod ever. So instead of like open the bestiary, and you see like all the beasts you unlock. You open your Kama Sutra and you see all the positions you unlocked. <laughs> that shit would be so good. I got, oh my, okay, we're good. I thought I was dead. Oh my God. <gasps> he saved me. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> Where is he coming from? How close is the desert to me? Bro, the desert's all the way over here. No way. He just pulled up on me. You guys know I was working on like a Terragrim video and then I generated like a hundred worlds and I couldn't find the Terragrim. Bro, what the fuck? Why is there so many minis or zombies? I still have that video like set up. That's why they, you probably will never see that video. Because after like a hundred some worlds, I couldn't find a Terragrim. And then my like Terraria started to crash because I generated so many worlds and I haven't came back to it since. Ow. Holy shit, that thing hurts. Oh my god. <laughs> that thing came in into 50 before I could even react. Jesus Christ, I hate that noise. Well, who decided that's the noise? Does anybody in the Calamity fucking dev group like ask each other, is this good? Do they like quality check with each other? Who decided that that's the noise? <laughs> Somebody just chose that noise and didn't ask anyone else. They could have had like the mana, like out of mana, like blink noise, like literally any other noise. <laughs> wow. wow. <laughs> why that noise that noise sounds scary as fuck too if i'm playing terraria and i hear that noise uh, bro <laughs> modded terraria too shit even not modded i'm gonna be like hold up there's an enemy i've never seen before what the fuck just made that noise wah, wah. <laughs> it's not like a mario character hey what the fuck <laughs> what is this guy doing up here Oh my god, I had a double jump. I forgot. I was praying to the Lord something saved me. And I saved myself. Steve the Miner. Shout out my boy Steve. He said, you know what? Mojang has been kind of ass. Let me take a visit to the real RPG crafting adventure game. Raby shot. What the? <laughs> oh, Steve. That boy dressed up like Steve too. Now what will she give me? Damn, <laughs> this is what she gives me? You think I want this free handout? Because like, it's a really decent armor set. 10% increased damage, early game. Oh my God, it makes the TF2 noises. I'm glad I picked this up. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I don't wanna go over here. <gasps> I need to stop jumping without a fucking grappling. <laughs> I just legit be jumping off. What is that, Flink's fur? <gasps> what the fuck why does slush kill you when you're like above it that happened with sand earlier and now the slush got my ass ah why is there so much lava <laughs> bro i want to fight king slime we need some average gear to do that though more than average gear i, I really just want to fight king slime i don't think we're gonna beat him there was some dude in like i posted the stream the first stream of this on the second channel and there was some dude that's like when you get to golem, you're going to have to disable one of the difficulties. And I was like, golem? <laughs> you think I'm playing past King Slime? You know, for this being like the super crazy, every difficulty enabled, it really doesn't feel that bad. Like fighting regular enemies does not seem bad at all. From what I've seen of like all eternity mode bosses is like, it's like you're playing Gungeon or Isaac. <laughs> what the hell? That thing is tanky as fuck. Oh my God. <laughs> Why do you burn? What's the other debuff? Lethargic. <laughs> so if I'm in corruption water, I, I just like catch on fire. How interesting. All right. <laughs> Why is he fucking gigantic? <laughs> oh my God. Hey, good damage. Good damage. Some schleich. Some schleich. See if I are legit, legitimately, legitimately playing these harder difficulties. Like I wouldn't fight the King Slime until I'm like platinum armored up. 400 health. <laughs> Best weapon I could possibly get my hands on. Like, I could probably do like three streams before I try to boss in this difficulty. Oh my god. <laughs> my boy falling from the heavens. Chunky. Okay, he like insta-killed whoever that was. Truffled the squirrel? Honestly, not surprised. A decent damage being put out though. I'm not gonna lie. The 
If I got room to run, I'll just fight. This. What the heck? I'm dead. Decent damage I'm putting out though. Maybe if I put in a little bit more effort, <laughs> this would be defeatable. Oh, juke them. Juke them. I'm dead. That's great damage. <laughs> that is great damage. I bet I really could kill this motherfucker. I just need more room. If I had more room, this boss fight would be so doable. Like, you don't even get it. If I had, like, enough room to run across from one side of the world to the other. I think I could beat him. <laughs> I really do. Elden Ring is easily game of the year. Because what other shitty game or what other game is coming out is going to beat it? Saints Rose? Hell no. Maybe God of War. Stray? What the fuck? <laughs> no way you just came in here and said Stray is going to be Elden Ring. <laughs> but Stray could be the greatest game ever. That shit would not beat Elden Ring. That shit literally could be perfection. That shit would not beat Elden Ring. Popularity alone. That shit would not beat Elden Ring. We all know that game of the year is just a popularity contest. What do you think Last of Us 2 won? I can't move! <laughs> Don't I have a... I do have a blizzard in the bottom. Why was I jumping so low? What the fuck? Why this turn into a bully that long as I am talking? We went from Terraria to Gungeon real quick. If I stand in this lava pit and summon in King Slime, I mean, it's okay damage, but like, I don't know. <laughs> Seems like a lot of effort to have to stand in lava or be near lava and not take damage. I think the best part about the Fargo's mod is like how everything gets like a different sprite. Oh, Empress of Light? In eternity mode? She kind of bad, though. Wow, this looks like fun. I, you know, I have so much fun fighting regular Empress of Light. <laughs> this looks like a lot more fun. Let's fight something more my speed, like the Storm Cloud. Yeah, I bet I can beat this guy. I'm going out of God mode. This guy is actually a post Eye Cthulhu boss. He kind of hurts. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> he kind of hurts. He really is post Eye Cthulhu. Back in God mode. Back in God mode. 